Hello guys, another vlog. Um, hmm, what's this one gonna be about? Um, how about this one be about Skyrim? Why not? Uh, yes, let's talk about Skyrim because I feel like it and love that game to death. Um, let's see. Um, my character in Skyrim is a Khajiit, you know, like I said in my other video about games. Um, now I'm a level 23, and I finally got done with the mage storyline, so I'm now the arc mage or archmage of the college. And I'm also the head of the Thieves Guild, so that's pretty cool, I guess. Um, but, uh, she, yeah, like I said, she's, she is a level 23, and I'm hoping I can get the perk eventually to make my enchanted weapons stronger, because it's kind of annoying that I can't do that right now and I can't you know get rid of the magical things on them without destroying the actual weapon and I like to keep my weapons you know especially the ones I use a lot I like to use that elven mace a lot that's like my one-handed combat weapon that I always use and uh, yeah I like that a lot and then her name is Vex V E X and like I said in the other video I didn't know that there was another Vex in the Skyrim world and she's also a thief and when I heard them say Vex the first time I was like me are you kidding me but no it was the other female thief in the thieves guild and so I kind of felt stupid and I kind of was sad because I couldn't change her name. But uh, and I'm playing it on the PlayStation 3 so I don't, I can't get cheats to do that. So unfortunately I'm stuck with that name. But I've been thinking about like starting another whole thing with a different character with an orc maybe or an Argonian I'm not sure I don't know I just want to make an orc character so bad for whatever reason because they're so weird and interesting but uh, yeah anyway so I completed this one this one side mission where you had to deliver an axe from Ulfric, Ulfric to uh, the Jarl of uh, Whiterun what, is it White Run? Runner One? I don't know. White Run, yeah. And, uh, yeah, I just got done doing that, and I'm apparently now Vex Ice Veins, which is pretty cool. So neat that I now got a last name. Uh, and it, go, it meshes together pretty well with her first name, anyway. But, uh, yeah, I love that game. I was stuck, though, before all that on the mage quest where you had to get the staff of Magnus and I was so angry every time that stupid dragon priest killed me and it wasn't until later I realized that shock magic killed him faster than just hitting him with you know weapons so I eventually killed him with the assistance of a companion and the uh Call of Valor shout, which I got after I beat the uh, main quest, and that comes in handy. And so does the Call of Dragon shout that you get after you save the uh, Ovaving. What is his name? I think the dragon's name. Anyway, that's the shout you get after you save him, and he takes you to the place you need to go to kill um, the one dragon. I may be spoiling things, but. I'm sorry, there's videos up of how to do those things and what's going on, so I mean, I guess I'm not spoiling too much, but anyway, 
Uh, so yeah, you get those two awesome shouts. And I'm still going around trying to find more shouts, but... So far, the shots I have are pretty awesome. Um, my dog sleeping on my desk. I made a little bed for him. That's how spoiled he is. He's, you want to, you guys want to see him? He's a pug. I mean, I guess I might as well show you what he looks like. Oh, it's Stonewall. Stonewall. Oh, he's flicking his tongue. I think he likes you guys. You guys make him happy. Stonewall, look at the camera. He's like, no, I'm camera shy. Don't make me look at the camera. I'll flick my tongue out. Oh, and I'll yawn. Oh, oh he's so cute. Oh, he does that a lot. It's so weird. Oh, look at him. He's gonna... Oh. <laughs> he looks annoyed. Like, he's like, why do you do this to me? He likes it, though. He likes attention. Don't let him fool you. But yeah, that's his little makeshift thing on my desk. He's so cute. Aww. Isn't that cute? But yeah, that's Stonewall. The pug. Um, also, Skyrim again. Um, I finally killed two frost trolls, and those things were a pain in the ass. But the easiest way that I did it was having my elven, el elven, elfin or elven? I think it's elven. Elven mace, you know, charged with the shock enchantment and conjuring a uh, fire archonac or something like that. Cause fire like kills them faster. So I mean. The thing is like fire spirit thing anyway, so that helped kill it quicker. So I killed two of those when I was on that mage quest. Then I came out of that quest after finishing it and encountered another frost troll and this one was even harder to kill for whatever reason. But uh anyway. Um Mammoths those are fun to try and kill by yourself. Um, I think I don't I don't know how many times I died trying to do that in the open where the giants could smash me and make me fly in the air. Which is fun to fly, except for the fact that you're dead and you're flailing about. Um let me think. I killed uh two mammoths actually though. But I cheated when I did it, cause I um was hiding in those ruins by White Run, and there's like a little opening thing. Uh, and I was just shooting constantly arrows at them, and that killed them pretty fast. Also using shouts, I can't remember what shouts, the fire shouts, yeah, and. uh it also helps having a companion with a huge sword. I can't remember how many companions I've gone through so far. A lot. I went through Lydia. The first one you get. And she was killed by Frost Troll the first time when I was like a really low level. <sighs> she sacrificed herself so I could live. Yeah. Then there was another person, I think it was a dog I got in Markreth or whatever that is, the Dwarven City, and it died. Then I've had two horses, and I've had many horses die on me. And then I got another dude, can't remember where he was from, had him for a while, he ended up dying. And then I got this chick at Whiterun, after beating her facing uh she died and then I'm with this one guy now that I found in oh, I can't remember where but I'm with him now and he's still alive thankfully uh yeah so I go through a lot of companions because of the fact that I go into a lot of dangerous places and let them do most of the work but uh yeah 
Oh, he's moving. He's gotta get himself situated. He's so cute. Anyway, this video is really long now because I like to talk about Skyrim. Um, uh, yeah, so I think I may make another Skyrim thing with an orc because I've seen like a lot of orcs in the world and there's like so many cool things you can do with them. But uh, yeah, I'll probably make another video talking more about it or something else. So yeah, peace out.